One, members lost zero. And one step closer to a brighter future. Hell yeah! Guys! Lower your voices, huh? People are listening. Oh, All right. <laughs> ah. hm. Now get some r, &R. You've earned it. Just be ready for the next mission, all right? Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> See you soon. Uh, at Seventh Heaven. You know, where Tifa works? Don't keep her waiting. She'll worry. So, I'll go there, baby girl. Not long now, honey. <laughs> that is almost home. I think he's over. What? Apparently, Shinra thinks. So I'm crazy. Huh. Hmm? Sector 8 was a nightmare. Fires everywhere. Huh. Mako is the lifeblood of the planet? Yeah, the hell it is. Goddamn eco warriors with their dumbass posters. I tear them down and they're back up inside of an hour. Like I've got nothing better to do. I mean, look at all that steelwork. You trying to tell me that's not progress? <laughs> 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 What the? You okay, buddy? <laughs> Mako Junkie, huh? Figures. You again. That hot shower can't come soon enough. I can barely tell my skin from all the ash and sweat. When I get back, it's refueling time. And you, Jesse? I don't know. Figure out how I screwed up? Ha! <laughs> You're such a kidder. Where'd you get that? 
I can't remember the last time I saw a real one. Huh? How sweet. When did you get so thoughtful? A guy can change. It has been five years. Huh? I need to talk to Barrett. Right. Come on in. Daddy, the Mako place blew up. Everyone on TV is talking about it. Don't you worry about all that silliness. Daddy's here and he's not going anywhere tonight. Now turn that thing off and let's get you to bed, huh? Do you mind keeping Marlene company until I'm done with this? Me? Yeah, you. Yeah, yeah, your money. Ask Tifa. She takes care of all that. Uh. <laughs> hey! Uh, the hell Barrett. you think you're doing scaring my daughter like that? Daddy says never talk to strangers. <laughs> That's right, honey. I do say that. What a good girl you are remembering daddy's lessons. <laughs> You know what else good girls do? They go to bed on time. Come on. But I'm not tired. I want to talk some more, Daddy. Mm, all right, but just this once. <sighs> uh, so then, what can I get you? My money. I'm still waiting on it. Uh, right. About that. We should talk outside. People who died all returned to the planet? Of course. Before we get on to money, there's an empty apartment in a place just down the road. It's nothing fancy, but I was thinking you could stay there for now. The landlady's a big friend of the cause, so you wouldn't even have to pay rent. Sound good? Sure does. Thanks. <laughs> Follow me then. How was it up on the plate? It was... When the Mako chaotic. Exploded, Sorry for dragging you into shape. all this. It was, crazy. it was wrong of me to put you in danger like that. I promise I won't do it again. Dangerous part of the job. Don't worry about me. <laughs> I'll try not to. Always happy to help stick it to Shinra. How'd that go? Not good at all. I don't know what it is. So, you make nice with so everyone? Empty. Much as I could, all things considered. Maybe not enough for them. Good. You had me worried. You're not exactly a people person. I'll give you that. I saw Sector 8 on the news. It was like a war zone. The news is just another Shinra mouthpiece. They'll spread whatever lies Shinra tells them to. One of my so, friends said they saw it, it wasn't that bad? I thought reactors were safe. Oh, right. And here we are, good old Stargazer Heights. You're on the second floor. Room 201 here is where I sleep. Don't have time for much else, what with Seventh Heaven and all. <laughs> Not even time to decorate. Here's your room, 202. Don't worry, I already told the landlady about you. You did? Yes? Oh, I mean, I told her I had a friend looking for a place to stay. Was that too much? No. It's fine. And this? That one's, uh... Know what? It's getting late. I'll introduce you tomorrow. It's 
it's a little bare, but should be enough to get you through the night. If you want anything else, we can always there get it. There is one thing. My money. You guys owe me 2,000, remember? I do. And we'd love to settle up, especially since this was your first job for us, but... That's it? Sorry. We spent the rest preparing for the mission. That really is it. But not for long. I'm collecting money for filters tomorrow, so I can pay you after. <sighs> and you're sure about that? Of course, as long as you help, that is. Wait, then I'd have to pay you for that, too. Never mind. No, two thousand's enough. That's what we agreed on, so that'll be the price. With what you gave me, that leaves fifteen hundred. You're the best! I'll see you bright and early at the bar, then. Thanks again for everything. Sleep tight. <sighs> It's time for introductions. Hey, you okay in there? Oh. Coming in. on him now and then to make sure he's okay. Can I ask you to do the same? Sure. Well now, you must be Cloud. I'm Marl, your landlady. So how'd you like the place? You from up on high? I've been around. I'll bet. No matter. All kinds come through with all kinds of reasons. If you ever need an ear to bend, I'll lend you mine. Can be about anything. Even Tifa. What's she to you? The granddaughter I never had. And if you hurt her, I'll take it out of your hide. You hear me? Loud and clear. 
Go. Now you'd best get a move on to Seventh Heaven. She's got a head start on you and then some. My husband decided to go to the Just imagine if rich people saw me. I know the husband. You ever see the Don't take your eyes off me. Everyone's worried they're gonna run out of money. It's a sad day when people care more about what's in the world. Morning. Hey. Just so you know, Marlene's still asleep. <clears throat> Let's get down to business, shall we? Huh? These water filters won't replace themselves. Although the next batch probably could, if Jesse put her mind to it. Most every home in the area has one. Folks love them because they practically eliminate the rotten egg smell. Honestly, they make us more money than this place. And it's easy money too. We bring new filters, collect the old ones, and get paid. What? <sighs> Give me a break. I'm not a salesman. I'm a soldier. Which is why no one will refuse to pay. What do you say? Please? Let's get this over with. Great. And while we're at it, I'll give you the grand tour. Go ahead and keep whatever we collect. Seeing as you didn't bring any luggage, I'm guessing there's stuff you need to there's buy. So many people Thanks. Just don't get the and don't worry, we'll pay you the difference after. Barrett's out making his rounds too. Don't take your eyes off your tool. Some creepy dude hit on All the items you could want are straight from the place. No matter your needs. Hey there. Here to change out your water filter. Tifa, baby, how you doing? Been waiting for you to. Wait. Let me see. Cloud's in charge of collections. He'll take your money. Sounds like a pretty sweet gig. If you ever need someone to fill in, I'm your man. In your dreams, maybe. Huh? Cloud! Uh, since we're here, maybe we should do a little shopping. Suppose I could take a look. Nothing tickle your fancy. If you change your mind, you know where I am. That goes for you too, Tifa. We'll see you around, okay? And let us know when your filter next needs changing. All the items you can want are straight from the plate. He's a regular. Stock up here and he might throw in a freebie or two. For you, maybe. Well, you could try being a little nicer. To get free shit? Not my style. <laughs> Our next stop is Stargazer Heights. Landlady's a client. Just met her. Then you know what to expect. Remember, she's a good friend of Avalanche, so be nice. Please. <laughs> Can't help but take a little pleasure in their panic. More than a little. Apparently it was done by a terrorist group called Avalanche. This isn't the first time they've come. Hey, Marl. Got some filters for you. Tifa! My dear, dear girl! Oh, what's he doing here? Working? Be nice. <laughs> Cloud's helping me with collections. You better take care of her. I'm pretty good at taking care of myself, you know. That I do. Still, better him than you. No charm, no wit, big sword, but no skills. I've got skills. Be nice. I'm doing my best. You're looking awfully glum. Are you getting enough sleep? A good long rest to cure anything, I tell you. A tried and true lesson for life on the ground floor, am I right? That you are. Now, your money. Thanks, Marl. You take care of yourself. Don't do anything I wouldn't do. Marl's great. She helped get me set up back in the day. You saying they're gonna been step here a while now? Five years, wow. give or take. They Absolutely. But never mind that. We've gotta get you your money. 
Last stop is the weapons store. Trains don't start moving again. We didn't have enough food and other goods to go around. Hey, if it isn't Tifa. You here for the filter? <laughs> That last filter didn't do shit! We're so sorry about that. Hopefully this one will work better. Save your excuses and get out! All right. If you could just settle your bill, we'll be on our way. The hell? You charging me for your busted ass goods? My associate handles payment disputes. Think you can mosey up in here and have it your way? Pretty please. <laughs> Thank you very much. Seeing as we're done with our rounds and you've got a small fortune now, why not take a gander at the weapons? Well, when will Barrett be back with the rest? <sighs> Before we open up tonight. It'll be a while yet, so... What do you want to do? Don't really know. In that case, I've got a suggestion. Want to hear it? If you're serious about becoming a merc, then you're going to need to start making connections. It's not what you know, but who you know, you know? Hmm. Another lesson for life on the ground floor. Yep. Connections get you jobs. Jobs build your rep. And more rep gets you better connections. How do I start? Hmm. Why not help out the Neighborhood Watch? They're mostly volunteers, but you'll get to know people. Yeah, okay. Didn't see anybody at the office, so let's head up top. No better way to keep you and your family safe than with a weapon of your own. Come and check out our selection. We gotta do something about the monsters on Scrap Boulevard. I'll head on down there first thing tomorrow. Not alone, you won't. Huh. Didn't know you were holding down the fort. Huh? Oh, uh, hey, Cloud. Looking to join the Neighborhood Watch? That depends. What does this Neighborhood Watch do? Uh, lots of stuff, really. But our top priority is taking care of any beasts that wander into town. That, and then teaching the locals how to defend themselves. Like they say, the only one who will look out for you is you. Cloud's a great fighter, but only we know that. If no one knows him, no one will hire him. Thought if he joined the Watch, he could get his name out there. That would work for everybody. Truth be told, we could really use your help. We can't pay you in Gil, but we'll work something out. For example, aha, uh -huh. what about your sword? I could mod it for you. No thanks, it's fine just the way it is. What, you some kind of purist? I know I'd never pass up a chance to improve my gear. Come on, at least let me show you how it's done. <laughs> All set? Needless to say, you'll have to try it out to appreciate the difference. Thanks. <laughs> we'll do you one better. Spread the word to everyone who'll listen about the new Merc in town. Between him and Wedge, there isn't anyone they don't know. I'll march through the streets singing your praises, even on an empty stomach. So, where are these monsters? Scrap Boulevard. Good hunting. Hey, Cloud. I'll come with. No. I've got this. But... You don't know the way, do you? We don't. <laughs> sure thing. I know these streets better than anyone. Scrap Boulevard is out west. Past the barricades is supposed to keep the monsters out. Anyway, we should prepare, just in case. Is that who Wedge meant? That sword's massive. Any harm comes to her. Here's Scrap Lullaby. I can see why monsters would feel right at home. <laughs> and the more we pile up, the more they show up.
There's our first one. No. Show me what you got, Cloud. It's over. Wow. So that's what a soldier looks like in action. This was just a warm up. <laughs> I'll bet. Ed, let's keep at it. Take the lead. I got this. Charging in like it was nothing? You too. It's a little surprising. Well, I've been here five years now. If you don't look out for yourself, no one else will. By the way, that one's gonna be on the test. This a lesson? Gotta learn if you're gonna stick around. Okay, let's wrap this up. <laughs> Bye! <laughs> okay, let's go! All right, I think that might be the last of them. They won't stay gone for long. Of course not. Even so, folks will be grateful for the peace and quiet in the meantime. A win's a win, you know? True. Trust me, it'll do wonders for your rep. Right. Let's go check in with Biggs and Wedge. Gather vital information from my research. I look forward to receiving all of your future battle intel. I hear you, so. No better way to keep you and your family safe. What? Back already? Got every last one, too. Now the slums should be safe. You guys are machines! Good job. Meanwhile, we told everyone we could about you. So I heard. I've got to ask, though. What did you tell them? It's all right. All you got to do is keep up the good work. It'll pay off soon enough, I promise. How's the sword, by the way? Good. Glad to hear it. Seems like the perfect fit for you. Yeah. We've been through a lot. <laughs> You okay? I'm fine. Been meaning to ask. After you left the village... It's a long story. I've got time. Why don't you tell me all about it while we try to wrestle up some more work for you? That sounds great! I'll come too! Oh, uh, no you won't. What? Run along now, you two. Sorry, Go on. maybe uh. next time. Huh? No fair! Uh, think about it for a second. They haven't seen each other in years. You'd be a third wheel. Uh, uh. Since you've got yourself a new weapon, let's see if we can't put it to good use. Come on. Let's go chat up Weimer. Who? The guy who tracks all the requests that come to the watch. You never know. Could toss some work your way. Where's he at? Oh, he should be back at the office by now. What? Everyone here is so in awe of your skills that they decided to die the way in the monsters are. Oh, uh, hey there, Tifa. You need a helping hand? Actually, I wanted to introduce you to an old friend of mine. This is Cloud. He's a merc. Ah, uh, you don't say. 
Well, we're always on the lookout for experienced fighters to help us deal with the bigger critters. I'll take on anything. For the right price, that is. Experienced and cocky, huh? If it's a challenge you want, I might have a few good ones. Your clients can fill you in on the details. Prove yourself with these jobs, and I'll see if I can't find you some more. Thanks. Cloud! You were the first to gather the data I requested. Here is the rest of your payment. I have developed new materia. Would you like to see it? I plan to develop more materia in the future. Together, we can harness enough power to take down Shinra. I'll keep repairing more battle intel reports, which I hope you will assist me in completing. That went well. Could be you found your calling. Eh. Yeah. Was all right, I guess. Think of each job as an opportunity. Not to make money, but to build connections. It's not what you know, but who. <laughs> you remembered. Not a patient teacher. <laughs> Maybe not so patient next time. Oh boy. <laughs> oh, Barrett should have finished collecting his share of the money by now. So what do you want to do? Head back to the bar? I hear you sell swords. Tally a monster plane! No. Oh, okay. I was kinda hoping she could help me find my friends. I know someone who can help you. This guy right here. Really? Okay, let me tell you all about them. They have long arms and legs, and they're a little skinny. They like places where there's food. And nice people will give them treats when they ask. And small spaces. Oh yeah, and they're all cats. <sighs> I'm looking for cats. They're friendly, so if you call them, they'll come running. All three of them. By my friends, please. What's the That's source of all life? The life stream, right? Oh. If there's nothing you can't do, look at him good when right? I get sick of. I'm not gonna let you sleep. Get <laughs> yeah, and I don't even like stuff. I was supposed to be working. Topside today. Not anymore. They were saying there's parts of something. Something's wrong. Let's check it out. Stay away from me! Hold it! Settle down now. Get off me, assholes! I didn't do shit! Shut up, punk! Or what, huh? Screw you! What's Come going on? on? Why you Somebody gotta do me like went that? and stole some blasting data from a Shinra warehouse. So public security started asking questions, and you know how Johnny gets. It's because of the reactor bombing, I bet. I could be wrong, but something tells me they're not gonna settle for just roughing him up this time. We've gotta save him, Cloud. Is he Avalanche? No. He doesn't really know what we do. But he has his suspicions. And he's a talker. Actually, you know what? Maybe I should go alone. I'm coming. Uh, are you sure? It's the least I can do. Lead on. Thanks. Come on. He could go to jail. Pretty sure security Why took Johnny that way. Come on. 
Let's get a closer look. Guys, is there any way to treat a model citizen of Midgar? Model citizens don't steal blasting agent. So why don't you tell me why your ID popped when we were going over the warehouse logs? Huh? You've got it all wrong. I've never gone anywhere near a Shira warehouse. Your ID was never lost, dumbass. We have never gotten you inside a shipper installation in the first place. But show you, we'll take all the time we need to help you keep the story straight. I swear. All he had to do was keep his mouth shut. Yep. Anyway, you distract the officers and I'll figure something out. Let him go. Hmm? Who are you? The cavalry? Huh? Is that... is that who I think it is? Oh, hell yeah! You guys really came to save me! Out on the... Who? Hey! I know you think you're doing it! Here we go. <laughs> Going in! Oh! What now? He's a talker. Huh? Whoa, whoa! No! Huh? You're not gonna... Hold up! Wait! Don't, don't do it, man! You wanna live? Then get the hell out of town. <laughs> you, you got it, boss! You ain't never gonna see my face again! I swear! <laughs> Are you sure about this? It's a big risk. I know, but... It's fine. And them? No more. Cloud, you're scaring me. <laughs> we need to go before they wake up. I... I'm worried about Johnny. I'm more worried about us. We gotta go, right? Right. What? It's just... You've really changed. How? I suppose it's... Yeah. Your eyes. They used to be less... It's the Mako. Soldier, remember? I remember. So, what do you want to do now? Head back to the bar, or do you want to tackle another job or two? Seventh Heaven tonight. <sighs> People are beginning to stop. Don't take your eyes off me. A friend of mine is like another. All the items. Just imagine if rich people. Hey, I'm trying to get a cat to come out. It snatched one of my pastries and scurried in there. Will you be a deer and lend me a hand? This sucks. Ugh, screw this.
Lots of girls who live here have a retention. I've been told this. Good luck with the new business. Hey, Miss Lockhart. Who's that guy? Aha, the man with the straight job. You know, all the items you could want are straight from the place. Hey there, Tifa. Welcome back. And you, the new Mercantown, looking for work, right? Yeah. In that case, maybe you could do something about the Doom Rats? Them and their were rat buddies have been tearing up town, looking for food and whatnot. Got into the store and made one hell of a mess, let me tell you. <laughs> oh, you think that's funny, do you? Don't lie. I saw you crack a smile. Well, do the job and you can laugh it up for all I care. Anyway, they're probably nesting in the outskirts. Now I've heard a were rat in pain will call its friends for help. And the whole rat pack will come running just like that. All the items you can want, straight from the guess I'll... Now, no holding back. Enough. <laughs> You're mine. <laughs> it's over. I got it. Let's do this. Would kill for a shower. managed to get those doom rats, huh? Thanks, guys. You're the greatest. Was so dead in here, I thought I might have to close up shop for good. Hey, got an idea. Hear me out. If the guy who took care of the town's rat problem told everybody where he liked to shop, well, what do you say? I'll make it worth your while, of course. Give you some incentive. Talk you up to Weimer and my customers and anybody else who listen. You'll be swimming in work before you know it. Yeah, sure. <laughs> okay then, that's what I like to hear. Seventh Heaven, the new Merkin town in my little store. I can see it now. We're gonna clean up. Thanks to the awesome new Merkin. Another day. Oh hey. Thanks for helping out a fellow entrepreneur. Hey, this look like a blood stain to you. Shit, not always there? Huh. Don't know how we missed it during the inspection. Better not make it a habit, or we'll lose out. I'll have a little chat with my man. I've heard so much about. You're not here to shop, are you? People were right. You look like you can handle yourself. So some drakes have made themselves at home in the abandoned Talliger factory. Can't have that kind of trouble around here. My regulars will do anything to get their hands on the scrap in there, and if they run into those drakes, they could get hurt. I'll handle it. Much obliged, sir. Head on over to the old Talliger factory and talk to Narjan. He's the watchman guarding the entrance. Good luck. I'm counting on you, my friend. Johnny 
Looks like I'm not the only one. You never know. If the planet's Step back. Factory's off limits. Drakes have been spotted inside. Huh? Wait a minute. Tifa? Don't tell me you're here to take care of those things. Are you? In that case, be my guest. We believe there's at least two groups lurking somewhere inside the factory. Find and cull them all. Don't hold back. You got it. No. Don't overdo it. Let me handle this. Bye. Too late. Not that. Good luck. Take it over. Ha. Keep it together. Okay, let's go. That's the way to do it. Quick. Not a problem. Get ready. Just like that, okay? I got you. Won't be tough. Of course not. It's on you. All set. Bye. See ya. You're good at this. <laughs> Told you so. Won't be tough. Alright. Well. Keep those gloves up. Sure thing, coach. Got rid of those drakes in the factory, did ya? What a relief. I can't wait to give my regulars the good news. You're the real deal, all right. Keep it up, and I can see you going far as a merc in this town. I've worked with my fair share over the years, so believe me when I say that I know what I'm talking about. Anyway, you're needed over at the pillar. Apparently another flying bastard stirring up trouble. Bet you can't get enough of this, huh? Well... No, I get it. If you're good at something, might as well make it your living. May not know you, but I know a man who's found his calling when I see one. Keep at it. I switch out my stock every so often, so drop by when you're in the neighborhood, huh? I'll bet a lot of people are talking about you right now. There's this amazing merc who can handle anything. Nothing I've done around here has been all that special, though. 
Oh, so you want more of a challenge, huh? Solid. Those disgusting vermin deserve it. Oh, hey! Thanks, for Thanks to the office. Chance to live we next should door. increase security to keep that vicious. Are you ready for more, son? Tally a, a certain shopkeeper told me you paid him a visit. Thanks for helping him out. Just so happens there's another job I'd like to offer you. Now that I know you can handle yourself in a fight, you've got a real killer on the loose, you see. A rabid catch dog. Maybe you've heard people talking about it. Shinra Muck gone feral. Last sighting was in Scrap Boulevard. Think you're up to it? I'll handle it. You're a lifesaver. Doubt anyone else around here stands a chance. Go get him, bud. Oh, is there anyone who can chase all that? Let's search out the dog is probably a bit of Stay alert now. Gloves up. Sure thing, coach. Took care of the dog, did you? Phew, we owe you one. Gotta say, I've never seen a Shinra breed like that before. Out of curiosity, when exactly did it show up? Oh, today. The first reports came in just this morning. Uh, why do you ask? Wait a minute. There's this crazy story about a Shinra research lab hidden right beneath our feet under the slums. Huh. Really? That's news to me. <laughs> and here I thought you might know something I don't. Well, I guess not. It's a big organization. I'm sure there's lots of secrets I don't know. Yeah, fair enough. You got the bastard. That's good enough for me. Looks like Weimer was right about you. Heard good things about you. Got the childhood friends left. Take a picture, why don't you? Space, man. I think we all know that if the planet What? Seriously? I'm sorry, but it's up. Tifa, you won't believe this. A Cerulean Drake flew in from the train graveyard, but these two clowns refused to get off their butts and do anything about it. Hey, is that 
It is you, the new Merc. Then maybe you can help us out. The Drake is in the old Telegraph factory over there. But to reach it, you'll need to get a hold of a watch security key. You should be able to find one inside one of the crates. I forget which. Just smash them all. Uh. The, the watch supposedly hired a train graver. I know. Recently, a rather. If it ain't the Merc himself. Let's end this quick. Not a problem. That's that. That's that. Was never in doubt. They're nothing. Compared to us, at least. <laughs> Don't overdo it. Let me handle this. Not that. Risk. Worked up a good sweat. That the key? Yeah. Just like that, okay? I gotcha. Coming through. Out of our way. Way to do it. And there he is. I knew you were the right man for the job. There's no denying you're the real deal. Not like these idiots with their excuses. I'd rather have one of you than 20 of them. They're just doing their jobs. Can't expect them to be at your beck and call. What exactly is it you're trying to say, Merc? You need people who can follow orders, too. I see now. Heard you were ex Shinra. Guess I shouldn't be surprised you'd go to bat for your old buddies. Me? I'm just looking out for my people. All there is to it. Hell with you. We can take care of this town ourselves. No more Mercs or Shinra. We'll build up the watch and kick you all out.
Okay, then. That's another solid gig in the books. You know, the whole town is really impressed with what you've done. Keep it up, and you'll have enough work to keep you fed for a lifetime. Well, thanks to you. And don't you forget it. So where do we get paid? The shop or something? Yeah, but why don't we head back to the apartments first? Take a quick breather. Which lesson was that again? Lesson one. Got it? Anyway, let's go. Good job ridding us of that pest. You never know. Glad we no longer have a rat problem. On the plus There's side, no better way to unwind after Who's a this good? Just has to look your own spirit. really knows how to play Where is that? I hope the people who die. I wonder if he's coming home. <gasps> it's the mercenary! Oh, mercenary My husband decided to go. What's gonna happen to Mika? Huh? Someone's back awful early. Not that I mind. Would you two be dears and swap your filters out for me? I left them in your rooms. Sure thing. Not so fast, you. Do me a favor. She needs a friend. A real friend. We're already friends. So when she talks, are you really listening? Thinking about her and her feelings? Or are you just going through the motions? Go on. Let's take care of this real quick, okay? Sure. Come over when you're done. One sec. I'll be done in a bit. <sighs> Finally. <sighs> so, after you left the village, hmm? I let you off the hook before, back at the hall, but not this time. Uh. Uh. Hmm? Well, when we were kids, everybody wanted to be a soldier, right? Yeah, I remember they were on the news every day during the war. Thing is, by the time I finally made it in, they didn't need heroes anymore. It was nothing like what we dreamt of. It was just working for Shinra. Just... I'm sorry. I know it's a touchy subject. Oh. Not exactly small talk. Especially with someone you haven't seen in a while. I get it. Still, it's kind of funny. Us going our separate ways, thinking that must be it. That we'd never meet again. And then here, of all places, we do. You know what? We should totally celebrate. Let's dress up and hit the town. Really? I mean, why not? It'll be fun. Do you even have fancy clothes? Not like fancy fancy, but I'll figure something out. What do you think would suit me, huh? Something refined. Yeah, I guess we're not kids anymore. Be sure to pick an outfit that goes with mine, okay? Will do. <laughs> this is gonna be so much fun. You'll see. 
Yeah. Maybe. <laughs> and on that happy note, I think it's time we headed back to the bar. Come on. Uh, you don't need a break? Honestly, I'm feeling pretty good. Marl isn't always right, you know. Hey, Marl. We took care of the filters, so we're gonna head back to the bar now. Take care, you two. Oh, you're looking pretty chipper. Uh, I don't feel that different. Must be my imagination, then. <laughs> anyway, keep your wits about you, Merc. A token of my appreciation. Be good to her. You'll get no second chances from me. And here we are. You must be tired. Same as you, I guess. Could use a little something to take the edge off, right? How about a refreshing cocktail made by yours truly that you can sit back and savor? Tifa. Yeah, I'm feeling it a bit too. Hey. Do you think you'll stick around a little longer? Maybe. Work for a minute, build up some savings. I see. So, what'll it be? Wanna head back out for a little while? We're back. Did you have fun? <laughs> Lots of fun. Hey, need y'all downstairs. Uh, right now? Then the plan is... Marlene, wanna go wait for Jesse out front? Okay. <sighs> <sighs> Looks like we're officially on for tomorrow night then. Gotta go over the details with the others. Before you do, about my pay... You'll get your money. So sit down and shut up until we're finished. Double time, Tifa. Sorry, but it shouldn't take much longer. In the meantime... <laughs> Grab a seat. What'll it be? I don't know. Something hard and bitter. <laughs> Most people would say something sweet right about now. I'm sure they would. Ah, uh, but you're a more discerning customer, aren't you? In which case... Our house special, the Cosmo Canyon. Beautiful. I gotta go. Uh, enjoy. Huh? Hey, you see the news? The reactor bombing was the work of the eco extremist group Avalanche. Public enemy number one. Gets your heart racing, doesn't it? They don't know our faces, so we're in the clear for now. But we'll want to capitalize on this momentum. Speaking of which, you coming on the next one? For the right price. Oh, you can bet I'll be pushing hard for a raise. <sighs> Tifa will be joining us too, but I don't know. 
Even a blind man can see her heart's not in it. She was never on board with the bombings, so if it comes down to do or die, if I've got to put my life in someone else's hands, then I'd rather that someone was a professional, like you. Could still kill some time. Maybe just chill a bit. I heard you're having second thoughts. I know we have to think big if we're going to make a difference. But not like this. I just... I feel trapped. If it feels wrong, don't do it. kick you out we agreed to disagree so you want another drink Tifa time to celebrate break out all the good stuff oh sure <clears throat> we won't be needing you for this next job feel free to look for work elsewhere fine by me that's how I like it no contract no obligation. Figured you'd say that. Here, the rest of your payment, along with a little extra for your exemplary service. And thus concludes our business. Gonna have to ask you to leave now. This is a private affair. it over but in the end we didn't want to put so much on you this is our fight jesse what's the hold up be right there no hard feelings huh it's fine let's talk more after i'm done here okay really it's fine come on jesse i'm dying here i'll catch you later to keep you thirsty boys waiting. Avalanche! <laughs> <laughs> <sighs> that 
hit the spot. Damn, Biggs, slow down. <laughs> Keep it tight. What's up with them? Big guy with a gun for an arm. So he's the rat slayer. Hey, brother. You from around the way? I guess. No big man with a big gun strapped to his right arm. Pretty set up shop somewhere in the neighborhood. That depends. Ah. <laughs> Clever. Smell an opportunity to make some scratch, do you? Five hundred. Two hundred. Mm, three. Shh. Whatever, man. Let's find somewhere quiet to talk. Walk with me. Hey! Got something what? to say? <gasps> you looking at me? <laughs> I so said sorry. move! Look at all these assholes staring at us. This shithole's got nothing on wall markets. Am I right? Don't overdo it. Word of advice, Blondie. Don't piss off my friend here. You'll be real sorry. Unless you got some kind of death wish, then be my guest. <laughs> After you, brother. And don't worry. I ain't the backstabbing type, most days. Spill it! You know where the bastard's hiding, don't you? I told you before. That depends. Oh yeah? You wasted my time! Shinra's time, you mean? Shinra knows better than to stick its nose in my boss's business. Like I give a shit. No holding the nuts. <laughs> big man with a big gun for an arm, right? Why do you want it? <laughs> So if they weren't Shinra, then... Not my problem. Lesson one for life on the ground floor. Get some rest. Scenario. Everyone's talking about. <laughs> Welcome home, honey. Took your sweet time. Uh. <clears throat> Psych. <sighs> Are you gonna let me in so we can talk in private? I'll get right to the point then. Huh. What have you got there? An apology for not getting you on the mission. Uh. Or not. What do you think it is? A proposition. Nailed it in one. Gonna have to ask you to keep all this a secret from the others, though. It's a personal matter. Something I need to sort out tonight. Tonight? Tonight. You and me, together. I want you to come with me to the Sector 7 plate. I'll give you the details on the way. That's fine by me, but don't you have a pretty big day ahead of you? I do, but if I don't deal with this now, it's only gonna get harder. Anyway, I can count on you, can't I? Hmm. A down payment. Doubt we'll be back before morning, in case you were planning on traveling one. You all set? Awesome. Meet me at the station after dark. Don't be late. It's 
Just another job. Tough break. They changed the times. Last train's already left. Which is why we borrowed these bikes. Need a lift to the plate? How did you guess? Easy. You've been acting weird. Like talking about one thing when you're obviously thinking about something else. Yeah, and don't get me started on all that pep. All right, I'll give you that. But how did you know I wanted to head topside? Was I talking in my sleep? What else did I say? No, we just figured you wanted to see your parents, that's all. Nailed it, huh? Yep, right on the head. So, seeing as we don't have any family of our own, how about you let us be a part of yours for a bit? You know, spread the wealth. Hmm. Are your parents still around? Huh? Uh, no. Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay then, guess you're all invited. Here's to awkward family reunions. Yeah! yeah! I take it you boys have your brand spanking new IDs? Yes, ma'am. Then let's lay down some rubber. Crank that drive. Okay, you got it. You hear me? Yeah. Just so you know, I'm not going plate side for the reason they think I am. Look, you saw the way the reactor went up. It was huge, right? Because of all the Mako. Isn't that what you said? Yeah. That was wishful thinking. Deep down, I know it was my fault. I used a more powerful blasting agent than the directions called for. It had nothing to do with the Mako. Let's say you're right. So what? I'm planning on using a weaker blasting agent this time. But, since I can't get in touch with my supplier, our only option is to loot a warehouse owned by Shinra. Shinra? Good luck with that. With your help, we won't need luck. <laughs> 